Shouldn't do this, Connor. Keep out of this, Lieutenant. It's none of your business. If you're gonna kill a man who wants to be free, that is my business. It's not a man. It's a machine. That's what I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. Deviant's blood may be a different color than mine. But they're alive. I have a mission to accomplish, Hank. It's best if you just stay out of this. Deviants are a threat to humans, Hank. They're the reason this country's on the brink of civil war. They have to be stopped. We're in this mess because we refuse to listen to deviants. Humanity never learns from its mistakes, Connor. This time it could be different. Step away from the ledge. After all we've been through. I respected you, Hank. I thought we were friends. Oh, yeah, I was just starting to like you, too. But then I realized you never change. You don't feel emotions, Connor. You fake them. You pretended to be my friend when you don't even know the meaning of the word. I know what happened to your son, Hank. It wasn't your fault. The truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Little Cole had just turned six. Shut up! Don't you talk about my son! He needed emergency surgery. But no human was available to do it, so an android had to take care of him. Poor Cole didn't make it. An android killed your son, Hank, and now you want to save them? No. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. All this time, I blamed androids for what happened, but it was the human's fault. Him in this fucked up world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. Killing you is not part of my mission. I'm glad to have met you, Hank. I hope one day you can get over what happened to your son.